So I said I was slacking off on Let's Plays, not no Let's Plays. But that just means that when I do them, I get to play something I really enjoy and not just to make content because I need to fill a daily schedule. So today we are playing one of my favorite horror series, um, and they have a new episode. It's called Fears to Fathom, Woodbury Getaway. Now, I know you've probably already seen this already, but I want to experience myself. I haven't watched anybody play it. Um, so come get square, scared with me. Let's come get scared with me. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Okay, I'm excited. I, lo I love the Fears to Fathom series. I really do. I've played all the other ones. I haven't played them all on the channel, but I have played all of them. December 8th. It's Taco Tuesday. Oh, look at this. I need to get coffee. Space to get up. Okay. I remember working. I used to work night shift. I've <clears throat> talk, talked about this a lot on the channel, but I used to work night shift. And it was the worst. I hated it so much. I think she's probably just staying late after work. Or he. I think it's a lady. I, from the little bit I've seen. Um, okay. Got to start with the Keurig. Yes, here we go. Keurig time. Wow, that's the, <laughs> that's the fastest Keurig I've ever seen in my life. Usually it has to go like... <laughs> then it'll start pouring coffee. I need to put on a lid, okay? Oh, yeah. Sweet, sweet Java. Needed to use the restroom. Is this the restroom? Nope. Okay. Oh, restrooms. Right down this way. <laughs> Let's go. I am, in fact, a lady. Oh, God. Okay. Couldn't do it with the door wide open. All right. Well, let's close this door. And let's close this door. Let's take a piss. Oh, there's a piss meter. There's a piss meter, guys. Wow. What a game. Now, your footsteps already. There's always... I mean, of course. Of course. There it goes. It's the janitor. Probably going to get jump scared, but it's definitely the janitor. Here it comes. God, okay. <laughs> Broke my camera there. Sorry, ma'am. I didn't know you were in here. It's okay. <laughs> I like to clean late because it's pretty quiet at this hour. You working late again, huh? Not like it's any of your business, sir. You young folks sure do put in the hours. Make sure to take care of yourself. Uh, okay, you too, dude. Hey, dude. Don't shut me in here. My camera's glitching, and I don't know why. We're just going to deal with it, and we're going to go, okay? Sip my coffee. Head back to my desk. <gasps> There's a phone call. Who could be calling at this hour? Just enjoy the fact that my, cam my camera's freaking out. Yeah! <laughs> Uh, hello? Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Oh, there's, uh, voice acting in this. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is yeah. there... Oh, snap. Oh. I was starting to think Cut maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> um. Okay. Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Damn, Harp, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Uh, this seems cringy. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And hmm. Nora. Sure. And my camera bit the dust. Oh well, who cares? Um, enjoy. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? I just really want to see you and Nora. Just gonna do it after work. No worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Alrighty. Hey. Hey. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. Sure. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Nora 
and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. Okay, sure. It'll be just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. I'm just excited, I guess. All right, talk to you later, Harp. Okay. All right, let's book the... Oh! <laughs> I just have to fake type. Woodbury. Oh, that's $350 a night. I can't do that. Oh, God, it's gonna... Guess we're getting the haunted one. Let's be honest, though. After fees and everything, this ain't gonna be under $100 a night, but... Maybe this is a world where Airbnbs don't exist. I'm assuming you get hundreds if not thousands of stories sent daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. Sorry if, if some of it is written weird, but I was rushed. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth. Which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. Mm -hmm. I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway to rural Vermont. That's your first place. Don't go to Vermont. Which sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work. My other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Two days later... Oh, Jesus, dude. I'm Gail. Sydney, it's nice to meet you. Hi, I'm the killer. I've seen you a few times getting off the 10th floor when I'm home late from work. I'm a software engineer. What about you? I work at a consulting firm downtown. Oh, I see. Anyways, hope you have a great rest of your day. I need to get some groceries before the snow starts. You too. I got my suitcase in the elevator at first. Shut up, Mike. So, dude. Harp. Dot, dot, dot. Still how you hug people? Why don't you hug me like you miss me? Nothing is too good for Sydney Harbor. Okay. All right, fine. You, where, where my hug at? Thanks for picking me up. Wouldn't have it any other way. It'll be nice to have company on the way. This old truck brings back so many memories. This bad boy's been through a lot. You just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. All right. You got a dang old Ford Ranger. Where's my stuff? Did I leave my stuff? Oh, I just... I'm sure why I didn't just have that in my hand, but whatever. Perfect. Ready to hit the road? Uh, yep. I wonder if there's any collectibles around here. Trinkets or trophies I could get for the game. This is that kind of game, though, right? Wow, riveting stuff. Oh, look at the little bobblehead. It's starting to snow. I can see a little bit of resemblance. It's the cowboy spirit, I guess. Yeah, okay. Starting to snow. Uh, let's just sit back and enjoy the ride before we all get murdered, okay? Because, let's be honest, that's probably what's going to happen. Oh, hello. Isn't it weird we used to dream about escaping our college and now we are here? Now here we are. Trying to escape from the life we want to live. Uh, funny how that works. Change is just hard, like trying to adjust to a new job. How's it going so far? How's your new job going? Working on this project that uses machine learning to predict market trends is pretty cutting edge stuff. Oh my god, hey dude, pay attention to the road! Pay attention to the road! <laughs> Sounds like you're shaping the future. 
not quite Tony Stark yet. I'll take it. You never, you know, I never understood what do consultants even do. Look at the road. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, explain. Okay, that sounds like important work. Well, it is. It is, Mike, or whatever the hell your name is. Do I have? I guess I can't look at my phone. Uh, sometimes I miss college. Terrifying. There was a school, a school bus back there by the old house. Maybe it's a project. It's true. People renovate school buses. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something. Yep, that's true. Right, stop talking to me. <laughs> I just want to look out. The, I just want to look out and see what's going on. So have you got the alignment fixed on this thing? We are bouncing all over the place. A beep beep. Oh, that was close. I read on the internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. I don't care, Mike. <laughs> Turn on the radio. Oh, we each have our own vent knobs? Uh, I can put air on myself without you getting air? That's what I'm going to do. I'm not sure... How far is it now? How far is it now? Should be about an hour and a half from here. Oh my god, you know? Snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic space. I'm not gonna... Okay, look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. Alright, poet. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Please, God, let there be a time leap. Yeah, dude, I'm gonna be honest with you. I, You freak me out. There we go, thank God. I did not want to have to deal with that, Anna. By 14 p.m. Where are we at? Why is it so dark at 5.14? Like, <laughs> I understand it getting dark. I guess it's like peak winter. Check that out. I can't check anything out because you keep talking to me. Pizza. Oh, okay. I guess we're stopping, huh? I just want to get to the cabin, but all right. I got to tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. Pizza is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. I'm so hungry. I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Me too. All right, then Harp Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. All right, nerd. <laughs> Dork. <laughs> Look, I'm a huge nerd, and I don't talk like that. Apparently, as a woman, I can't open the door for myself. Man, okay, thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. This just in. Reports of a strong <laughs> snowstorm coming towards Woodbury tonight. Residents are recommended Is that to stay queso? That's queso. Warm during this time. Let's check in with our field reporter. How's the weather out there, Phil? Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands, okay? Like, uh, the studio should have really brought some snow. You probably should know who that is, but I don't. Machine. I'm sure you'll be fine. You can have some coffee when you get back to the studio. Jerry. You cannot be serious. You know my doctor said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's having a bad day. Maybe you should <laughs> cool off. You little shit. Why can't you go out here and deal with the snow instead of me? Ooh. I've been working here for six years and I never get to report somewhere nice. Listen, Phil. I'm just clearly the better looking one. You can worry about where you'll report once you get that rhinoplasty. Rhinoplasty? Why would I need rhinoplasty? My face looks perfectly fine. You could also use some Botox while you're at it. Actually, maybe you should just work as a studio light engineer behind the camera. I think it would be better field of work for you. You only got your job. Because you guys you're seeing this? The mixing board. You would have never been able to work here if it wasn't for her. I'd like to see you work the ENG sometime. How dare you? I'm a certified news anchor. Certified? Yeah, my ass, okay? Ooh. You didn't do shit. How about I come by the studio and we settle this like men? Oh, yeah? Well, let's do it, punk. We'll be right back after this commercial break. <laughs> well, that was ridiculous. Look, I I understand uh, using like streamers and YouTubers is in their game, but boy, they're not voice actors, that's for sure. Or line readers. Evening, folks. Look, looks like the cold's got everyone craving pizza tonight. 
Know what you want to eat? We'll get three slices each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and a veggie. Uh, cheese, pepperoni, and most special. Oh. Any drinks for you folks? That should cover us. Just the pizza today. Thanks. What do you mean? I'm thirsty. Loser. Those are some expensive slices, too. Hey, look at that guy carrying pizza. Your order is number 27. Just grab a seat and we'll call you up when their pizza's ready. You cheap piece of shit. I would have been like, okay, well, your truck's right out there. Why don't you go get your wallet? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> the hell's this guy doing? Rentacabin.com. Uh, where are you headed? Uh, I'm Sydney. Look, Sydney. We're just here to enjoy our pizza in peace. Thanks for understanding. Hope you enjoy your meal. I don't know why I would talk to them. I just don't want to do anything but talk to the guy I'm with. Get the cheese. Okay, thanks, dude. <laughs> He's like sitting down, waiting for me to sit down, doing everything but sitting with him. How's the pizza? I think Moe's might have ruined other pizzas for us. Uh, it's our first time in the area. We're on our way to a conference in the next town over with my buddy here. So, we just start to eat whenever a place looks interesting. Best decision of the trip so far. Local are just passing through. We're headed to a rental in Woodbury. You can come murder us there. Passed a sign for that, didn't we, Chris? Uh. <laughs> Better get back to your pe to this pizza. You have a safe trip to care for you. Okay, you too. All right, fine. I'll sit down and talk to you. Long sniff. What? It smells so good in here. I'm not doing a long sniff. Okay. Well. We're on the road, Nora. Let us know when you're getting out. Okay. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all... That's Lily Pichu. Why do I know all these? The long oh, and Lord. short of it is, one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it, and be on my way. Okay, well, delightful. Uh, yeah, I was... We're sitting in front of each other. Of course I did. Guess we'll have to start the fun without her. What can we do? I don't know what he's talking about, but I don't like it. Yeah, I guess I have to go get it, too. Oh, okay, well, I guess I didn't have to go get it. Oh, you got your own, okay. Good lord, you're the biggest jerk-off in the world. <laughs> you're all set? Okay, thank you. Eating the pizza. Eating the consuming pizza. Oh, damn, this pizza slaps. No one says that anymore, Mike. I, I just, I don't want to respond to you. <laughs> just let me consume my pizza, okay? Ugh, why does it sound like that? I hate it so much. Do we seriously have to do If there's one thing I hate, it's the sound of people eating, including myself. At least that's what my wife thinks. Hi there, my friends. Oh, um, I saw y'all pull in driving that nice old truck. You're just watching who pulls in and taking notes. I was heading down the road myself. Oh, God. Seems like we might have been going the same direction. Where are you headed? Just heading where the road takes me. I'm a bit of an adventurer. So, okay. Um, I'm not sure. I'm sorry. Just find, find just a little bit of room for me. I can ride in the middle. Hell, I'll ride in the bed. That's my friend's car. I'm sorry. You gotta be shitting me, lady. No space. I know, there, I know there's a middle seat. You scared of me or something? Sorry. Best be careful out there. Okay, all right. Are you threatening us? <laughs> Cold tires all. Yeah, okay, well. Beat it. I'm disgustingly eating this pizza right now, okay? Well, that was weird. Uh, I'm gonna watch him leave. He better not be hopping in the back of our truck. Beat it, dude. I think he's good. Uh, dude, it sounds like my dog eating. Sydney's probably uh, kind of 
kind of wasteful not to, don't you think? Eating the crust? Wouldn't really eat the peel of an orange, would you? Uh, dude, Mike, okay, I'm going to say this once. And then probably many, many more times after this. Shut up. <laughs> Shut your damn mouth. Pizza was perfect fuel for the last leg of our trip. What, dude? You got a problem with me burping? You've been in inconsiderate this whole time, you dickhead. Holy, that was good. Alright, then. Are you ready to hit the road? Uh, maybe we can beat the rush through the snow. Are we close? Let's see. If my GPS is right, it should be right about another hour. The weather is awful. Why don't you drive part of the way home? I'm going to drive so you can get a break. Take a break while I drive, Michael. You'll be afraid you don't get. You'll be afraid if you don't give me the keys. One condition: first choice of bedrooms, when or if we get there. Deal. Give me your keys. I'm gonna drive us off a cliff because I don't want to be here anymore. Drive slow and don't worry. I'll make sure Harp stays up and let you in. XD, XD Hearts. I got the truck keys. Deja vu. I have seen this place before. Please just cut to the cabin. I don't want to fucking drive. <laughs> 5.49 p.m. Is it going to make me drive? I really don't. Oh, God, it is. Vermont. This Hello. This is your host on WKWB, your hometown station, bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly night. It's That's like, I guess, technically, I could just drive us into season. another car. There's nothing like a perfect song to set the mood. So here's a track that will Road's a little skitty. <laughs> Coming up next. How do you think it feels when I drive like this, huh? Stay warm and stay tuned. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm a big city gal, all right? I don't drive anymore. Everything's fine. <laughs> but everything's fine. Shut up. My wife and I were uh, in the mountains this weekend for... Uh, celebrating our wedding anniversary and we ended up going down this sketchy barely like not really even paved road and uh holy crap was it spooky and it reminded me of this where it's like we were just like if someone comes the other direction we're screwed because it was so it was like a one lane road scooby doo on thursday i don't know where that taxi was going that taxi lost control while I appreciate this and the immersion that this gives, I also just kind of don't want to drive, you know? Also, how long am I supposed to drive like this? Like, lots of taxis out in the middle of nowhere. Did I hit something? <laughs> I don't know how far I'm supposed to go, and this cowboy's freaking me out. Jesus sets free. Oh, hey there, Chief. Watch out. Step into my room. Leave with what a weird song choice for this part of the game. But I guess it prevents it from just being quiet. Sorry, I gotta, f gotta follow the traffic laws. I could try my hardest and I'll never reach my goals. I know that I'm I drove past our cabin at first. Oops. My heart. Didn't want to change, but I think that today is a good time to start. How, how the hell am I supposed to know where it's at? It's a good time to start. Good time to start. So sit up here. Sunset dreams of the nights that I never knew. I don't know. Where's our cabin? It was a very cold night. Yes, that is true. Okay, you... You sure we can park here? Hell, I don't know, dude. Get in the car. I'm just tired of listening to this song. Alright. I don't know. I guess this is our cabin here. This should be it. <laughs> Fuck your truck, Mike. You suck. 
Quaint little house in a quiet neighborhood. He's like, I brought the beer. I didn't bring anything else. And that's how you close a tailgate, Mike. You inconsiderate piece of garbage. Door's locked. Had to get the key from the lockbox. Uh, hold. Left mouse button to slide. Oh, uh, I bet it's... Uh, let's see here. 5176. Bam, nailed it. Out of my way, out of my way. I get the bedroom first. <laughs> oh, this looks like a perfect place to get murdered. I'm so excited. Oh, there's a spooky basement. What a great place. I knew we could count on you. We'll need to hit the john. Take your time, Mike. While I'm gone, can you put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. But I'll drop my stuff. <laughs> I was like, oh, 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 This is my friend's song that I put into the game. La 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 la. I'm not really sure all of this stuff should go in the fridge, but what do I know? It's like, we I bought enough. Um, I had to close the mini fridge before picking it up. Oh, okay. Yeah! <laughs> Oh, wow, nice. Sorry about that. Harp had to take a massive dump. Did a number. Uh, well, all the groceries are put away. Anyways, this place looks crazy nice. It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. Uh, yeah, it's cute. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee. I'll be back. Oh, oh God. Mike, what the... <laughs> it just reeks in there. Somebody made that joke, right? <laughs> yeah, it the game made that joke. Well, I didn't. I clicked the toilet. Piss meter. Hi, we've checked in. I'm right behind you. Pee 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 in. Pee 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 in. <laughs> Come out, Mike's dead. Uh, you feeling better after the drive? I'm good. Want to check out the house? Sounds good to me. Oh, wow. Nice little movement there. Let's see what this place has to offer. Okay. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> da, 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 da. What's going on in here? Ooh, a room with stuff. I just open every door and just leave it. Good googly moogly, dude. I mean to... Yeah, uh-huh. Welcome to my home, sweet home. Oh, my God. We're not a couple. You didn't have to sell that hard. I was just answering his question. He did not ask a question, said he made a statement. You... Never mind. Okay, shut up. Uh, we didn't expect anyone to be here. Looking for a cat earlier, and then remember the tea has been on the fritz here. I just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again since the last few folks left a bad word for it. His face. Why are his eyes doing that? Treat your guests like family. My family doesn't go without tea. Let me show you around my sweet home. God, okay. I'd be a bad owner if I didn't. I'd be a bad murderer if I didn't. This was a middle-aged man with a nervous energy. This is my dungeon. Okay. Well, I'm going to go this way. I'm just going to... Oh, I have to talk to you? Okay. Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. The sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry. I'll get it fixed for you real soon. Uh, okay. Don't touch this secret latch. It leads down to my dungeon. This room has a nice-ass view. You think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Follow me now, please. Don't mind the blood on the floor. Just a little bit of murder juice. Oh, okay. Interesting. Second floor. I call this a patio, not a deck. Decks are usually on the ground. Oh, no, 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 never mind. I'm thinking the right. Why are their faces so close? Oh, this, this is incredible. Glad you folks like it. It'll be the last view you see before I stab you in the face. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing, too. Let's head back in before I catch the cold here again. 
Dude, I swear to God, if you don't stop looking at me with that ugly fish face, I'm going to punch you. Just so you know, I'm going to be sleeping here because I don't have another home. Here's the storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. Uh, if the power ever goes out, you can use this flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you know, never... All right, folks, let's head downstairs now. I'm going to just... Blink. Thank you. How's that feel, old man, huh? I should probably put this back. This is going to be a night. There we go. All right. I don't need it right now. Alrighty, folks. I see you already stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. You see the knob? Turn the knob on up for more cooling and down to cool it off. Need to tend... Need to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. Don't mind the corpses. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna phase through this fucking door real quick. Spook it real good. Okay. He's like, sorry, I forgot how light switches work for a second. Um, nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. If ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire it right up and you'll be back in business. Oh yeah, what's this? Oh, I, oh okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. You don't want me to see the bones down there, do you? Couldn't open the door. Oh, hey, sir, what's the deal with that room over there? <laughs> Nothing you two concern yourselves with. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. All right. I'm going to open that door, and there's going to be bodies or demons. Okay, come on, dude. Get the... Okay. Did I mention? Well, no, maybe I ought to keep it to myself. The fellow I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Said they could hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare you folks, but if I were one of you, I really, I wouldn't really step down here. Hey, 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 the looks on your face. I say, hee, 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 come on now, I'm just kidding. Okay, well, I don't know if I'd be making that joke on me. At this point, my creep meter was quietly pinging at around a 6 out of 10. I'm going to hit the road now. i got to find that damn cat. Thanks for showing us around. Okay. We'll see you later tonight. Don't go into the... Don't cross the rickety bridge. What was the name of the booking? I must be getting old. It's Sydney. That's right. Pretty name for a pretty girl. Okay. So she is that dude super weird. Very weird. Anyway, let's go see if there's anything good on TV. I'll find something to watch while you're in there. Let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall. I like how they just kind of walk away. Welcome to the Woodbury Getaway. Time to go take a shower. Can I turn this TV off? Thank you. I don't know why I left that running. I don't know what that is. This is the kind of bathroom that was in the last Airbnb my wife and I stayed in. It was... As a guy who's 6'5", it was miserable. Shower door was open. Okay. okay. I have all my clothes on. Okay. Does it feel like the Amazon rainforest? I guess we'll never know. <laughs> guess I put my clothes back on, huh? I swear to God, if, I, if he's pops out around the corner, I'm going to be pissed. I guess he's just down here. We're never going to see Nora, are we? Found this fishing rod in that shed. That would be a pretty epic addition to the trip. I don't know, it's cold out there. Come on, Harp, what would you make this trip more epic than catching our own freaking dinner? Except that my hair's wet and I don't want to catch a cold. Alright, fine. I guess we're going fishing. And it phases through the ceiling. Gotta love it. Got some Minecraft-ass music playing. Now that we're all alone in here, Mike. Just kidding. Are the other fishing rod heart? Yeah, just give me a second. Okay, all right, fine. Oh, where the... Oh, there we go. I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. 
catch three carp, though. You up for the challenge? Yes. Well, first things first, we need the right bait for carp. Check out this bait information board. Grab a carp bait and let's head to the creek. Okay. Oh, there we go. I was about to say, holy crap. Um, this is very hard to read. Cheese delight. Alright. Just a little bit of cheese delight on a Friday night with my friend Mike. <laughs> Okay, I hope these carp are biting today. Yeah, okay. Okay, right mouse button to put on hook. Guess I did it. And now we play the waiting game. Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Got it. <laughs> Small math bass. I yeah, will throw it back. God, I can't believe this is. I mean, I gotta give it for a horror game. I've played so many horror, terrible horror games that, like, playing something like this is so refreshing. And the fact that I don't have to um, do this anymore, like, as far as, like, I don't have to. Um, I don't need a bluegill. Um, it's just so refreshing to not have to play a bunch of garbage just because I need to fill out a daily schedule and I can just play this. You know? You know what? We're going to keep it. That's not quite the fish we're aiming for today. Okay, well. Shut the hell up, dude. I'm doing my best, man. I'm really trying. What have you caught? I've caught like 47 fish at this point. Common carp. Let's go. I know there's one carp. There's always more. Well, let's hope so. And you might want to start catching something because I'm doing all the hard work. Go. Did need the the fisherman. Let's go. One more carp left. You got, yeah, you're doing Jack Diddley squat, dude. I'm doing all the hard work, Mike. You're not doing anything. You suck. I feel like this is one of those things, like, I I don't know. I get it. But at this point, it's already kind of... It's like, it's like fishing in Sonic for the Dreamcast. I hate it. And I'm not a giant purple cat in this one. Maybe I am. I don't know. I haven't seen myself. Could be. Oh, my God. Might have hit land with that one. Got this. Got this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nailed it. Oh my god. Mike, have you caught anything? Am I just jerking myself off here? I think I'm just jerking myself off here. This is kind of annoying, honestly. I was just talking about how this is so great. I can't catch nothing but bluegill. Like, in a game like this, I feel like you should just have it as a set amount. Like, I'm fine with not getting what I need immediately, but like the idea of actually having to uh, do this a bunch is kind of annoying. 
Jiminy Christmas. Definitely hit land on that one, but whatever. The fact that this thing's just firing forward. There's only I can't really... And now it's sitting in the middle. Oh my god, there's nothing I can do. Dude, just get over here. Just get over here. Oh my god. This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. Yeah, this is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. What am I trying to catch? A whale? Just stay in there, dude. Just stay in the pocket. Stay in the pocket. Like, I can't... Oh my god. This is a nightmare. What the... What am I supposed to do here? Just wait till... Yeah, oh my god, dude. Putting up a tough fight. Shut up, Mike. You've done nothing. That was awful. <laughs> that was awful. Like, the... the slider goes so far so fast I need it like this there we go if it is a bluegill I'm going to ah! ninety percent of this is getting cut out Oh, thank God, dude. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Okay. Fishing is awful. Put this in your head, Mike. Do you think Nora's in there while we've been out fishing? music's playing. Mike, I like how we left all the doors open. Oh, no, we didn't. Never mind. Still. <gasps> the spooky basement's unlocked. Da, 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 da. What's going on down here? What's going on down here? Gonna go through stuff. Okay, well, we'll just shut this door for now. So I'm assuming... Oh, okay. It's one of those, like, I'm going to have to crit. Somebody's going to be by the window. All right, Mike, get to work. I'm cleaning the fish. Do you mind prepping the marinade? Sure. Uh, just take a bowl and throw in ginger paste cooking oil. Effects. Okay, got it. I'm hoping that I don't have to remember all that. Oh, my God. Okay, well, at least it's over that. <laughs> That's good. Uh, Paprika. This. <laughs> this. This. Maybe a little bit of this. What else do we need? Olive oil and yogurt. Okay, this is going to be... Okay. The olive oil around here somewhere. You're doing great there, Chief. Cornflakes? It can't be in the fridge, right? Because if it's in the... Well, I don't need the bell peppers. I don't need those. Okay, this will just go there. I can't tell where the... Is it? Oh my god, this game, dude. Oh, there it is, of course. I just had to look up. I'm stupid. There you go, ding dong. Eh. <laughs> the fish and the marinade and the casserole while I was chopping this. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Give me the fish. Give me the fish. 
putting on a marinade. Da la la la. Oh, okay. I put the fish in first. You did a terrible job, dude. Their heads are still on there. Okay. Could you add the veggies? Sure. I read it needs to go for 30 minutes at 400. Oh, okay. I just automatically did it. Hooray! Perp are going to taste amazing. Let's hope so. I'll wait for it to cook. How about we play some board games? I guess I uh, saw some in the living room. Okay, just grab whatever kitchen you are. I can't wait to see what you pick. I saw some in the room next to the living room. Da 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 da. That is the bathroom. La 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 la. Um. I mean, we could do Ouija, but that would be... Let's just do this. <laughs> I know it wants me to pick the Ouija board, but Dad's not picking the Ouija board. Okay. Not picking the Ouija... Ah, tower stack. Nice choice, Harp. It's been ages since I played this. See how steady those hands are. Please don't make me actually play it. Oh, my God. It's going to make me actually uh, play it. Whenever you're ready, Harp. Oh, my God. It's really going to make me play it, isn't it? Okay, fine. Uh oh. What in the world? This game is complex for what it is. Smooth as butter. Yeah, okay. Whatever, dude. We're taking this one. <laughs> Give it another shot. shot. Okay, fine. Oh my God, I didn't want to have to do this. Can't touch the... Outside, this is probably not good for my tremors. <laughs> Am I? I just failed on the on the like the second one. Okay. Holy sh! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Seems unnecessary. I'm gonna do it though. This is why the game takes two hours to play. <laughs> Do I have to win? I imagine that I probably have to win. Which is obnoxious that I have to do this. But I imagine if I fail again, he's going to go, let's just do it again. Okay, dude. Whatever. Whatever, nerd. I'm trying to make this quick. Okay. Okay. Dude, Mike, just shut the... I should have picked something else. <laughs> Dude, I don't care what they call you. You know what I call you? Lame. Get knocked down, idiot. What the... Oh, I have to get... The... Okay, the dotted lines have to be touched. Okay, gotcha. There we go. <laughs> okay. Dude, why don't you just fail already? I gotta give it... I gotta... I just... This game... Does a very good job of... Like, it... As much as I... Kind of am annoyed by this, like... You gotta give this game credit for the fact that it's doing this. Like, it could be... It could be so much worse. Dude, just lose already, you nerd. I'm so... He's always picking the same one out. You know? We're really sitting here playing Jenga in this horror game. Whatever, nerd. Is this the only one I can... Oh, he, he missed. Uh, let's leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not playing Jenga with you anymore, Mike. Okay, that was a fun game, Hart. You really did well. Thanks, Mike. Okay, let's... 
Let's grab some plates. I'm starving. Why is this door open? Asbestos hands. Asbestos hands. Man's a monster. He just picked that thing up that's been sitting in 400 degree heat for 30 minutes. Uh, can't wait to eat this with my hands since we have no utensils. I'm going to sit over here, Mike. Guess I have to sit with him. I'd have to turn on the TV. Mike, dude, can you do anything? Arrogus chocolate cake oh, with God. a spoonful of mayonnaise. This delicacy is very popular in Romania. I hate mayonnaise this. Mayonnaise flows down the rivers like a mayonnaise water park. So first, at least it's kind of blocking out that disgusting eating aspects. sound that's been going on. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. Okay, Take I hate it. Take a couple it. cocoa beans. Uh, Since yes, we cut the fish or something, it was really good. Anyways, check my emails real quick. Let me left my laptop upstairs. It's not work. I'm just waiting on shipment details for an ATS. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. <laughs> we stir fry this. Okay, and this is being cut off. Holy crap! <laughs> There's some artistic choices being made that I don't really care for, if I'm being honest. Uh, I had to do both of our plates. Oh, Mike, you're the fucking worst, dude. And left it on the table to go worry about your DS. What is this, 2007? Dickhead. <laughs> oh, okay. Dishwashing meter. Dishwashing meter. Meter for dishwashing. We did it. We did it, gang. What a game. What's gonna jump out and scare me at this point, you know? Nora? Nora ain't coming. I think there's someone under my bed right now. Okay. Can you come upstairs? Oh god, he's gonna scare me. Okay. Boo! Jesus Christ, noob. God, fuck you. <laughs> my good looks are half of my charm, Harp. Don't mess them up. Totally got you. Uh, it's not cool. It's just a joke. Yeah. We go for the next round? Uh, I'll get back to you for this. Alright, you're on. I'll count to ten. I, mean, I didn't want to. I'm still crouching. Oh, don't go hide. Why would you hide in the basement? He said not to go down there. Also, Mike's going to struggle to count to 10, so we probably have more like 40 seconds. Can I open this door now? Oh, is it pick... Okay, sorry, I had to move the mic away from my face. It was going... For you good as a sense I never find you in the city. Uh, 
I don't want to close my eyes. There's probably some demon shit in there. That's how you count to ten, Mike. <laughs> Well, let's see where he could be. <laughs> Guy comes back, it's like, they just threw all my board games on the floor and left. Oh, that's right, I'm seeking. Oh, there he is. What's up, dude? Sydney, I really heard something sliding up there, didn't you? See this attic access door in here. Alright, fine, I'll look. We got a step stool somewhere, you dickhead. Aha. Nope, that is laundry. Over here, probably. Do I have to go back down to the basement? I really hope I'm not wasting all my time. <laughs> I hate that it does that. In a chair would work, I feel like. But I guess I need a stepping stool. How about this small table? How about this ladder? Have the number of things I've had I've found since uh, walking through here. Closing time. There's a bunch of chairs and stuff that would work for this, but I have to find a step stool. Hello? Markiplier? I should have just... <laughs> there it is, of course. Ooh, look at this. That's terrifying. Oh. Oh, it's the cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I guess I probably have to come pet you, huh? Yeah, okay. Mikey pussy. Maybe we can give her one of the carp after I come find you again. Now what would be cool is if I'm in the tool shed and I see Mike get murdered. I'm going to the tool shed. I'm going. This is the tool shed, right? What's the tool shed? Yeah, this is the tool shed. Okay. comes. <laughs> okay, whatever. Took me a while to figure out you left the house. Okay, my turn. Close. Okay, I'm getting tired. <laughs> Mike, I hate you so much. I'm going to stand in here and close my eyes. not saying anything, dude. Dork. Oh, I left that door open. That's gonna raise the heating bill. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear stuff coming from the basement. I'm going. Okay, I guess I was wrong. I guess he's upstairs somewhere. Okay, he's not in here this time. Probably should shut this door. Mike, you're letting all the cold in. <laughs> oh, what happened? Why the hell are you in here again? Should have told us. This is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. I feel like you probably should. <laughs> you ever fix many faucets yourself, young man? No. I think so. so now I'd imagine you don't know what tools you need. How long have you been here? Just got here a couple minutes ago. We need to go to bed now. Ain't no cops in Wordbearer, son. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. I don't know which of you I like less. <laughs> See what he's doing on his laptop. How to murder someone. How to moida. All right, well, he peaced out. After locking the door, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. We're gonna find my. We're gonna find Rick dead at some point. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. We attributed his behavior to extreme lack of social awareness. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I just wanted to get some rest. Eleven thirty-nine p.m. Uh, hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. I had to talk to you about something, for sure. What? What do you want, dude? Uh, the storm is starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry, I'm here to keep you safe. Guys are supposed to watch her people they care about, right? What are you talking about? This isn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place. Uh, yeah. I really need to sleep my, uh... Dude. No, 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 no. Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? Oh, God. He's gonna hit on me. Nope, I'm out of here. Leave me already, Sydney. All right, fine. She's gonna make a move on me. Us oh, just talking. It's been too long. You know, you don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. Would you be doing this if Nora was here? That's what I thought. I remember it being pretty awkward. Start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happen. They sure did. I'm hoping they can, maybe they can happen again. I don't even know what to say. Just let me worry about the details, City. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury, and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's 
hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep, and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? Hell no. Nah. Oh god. You're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You just settle in and I'll go help Nora. Oh god. Okay, get some good rest and stay warm. I'm gonna watch you leave, dude. I don't trust you. I wonder if I'll ever see him again. Uh, Nora's probably freaking out more than you right now. Should you take care of yourself? All right, lock all the doors. Uh, Where my hug at? Where my hug at? Ass motherfucker. He leaves, that'd be great. Oh my god, he's actually leaving. Alright, well, I can't lock the doors. I'm sure that's just assumed. What's gonna happen? I told myself things would be get, get better if I could just get some rest. Nor always knows how to cheer me up, and I need it more by the minute. Her arriving suit decided to rest in the meantime. 12.39 a.m. No oh, lord. Oh, I'm all dazed and hazy. What the hell? I'm in a bad spot here. You're not coming in. Did make you go hiking in a snowstorm. No, it's that same guy. Please just leave her. I'll call the cops. Lord have mercy. He's still standing there. Terrifying. Let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. Well, I'm just gonna go back and go to sleep. That's literally what I'm doing. I feel like I would not sleep at all till that guy got in a car and left. <laughs> what was that? The spooky stuff's are happening. This is something I should keep. Closed and locked. Yeah. Spooky. Maybe we should just go. 
go down into the basement and hang out. That's probably Rick. Could have been anyone or no one at all. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Still didn't feel safe opening the door. By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was with you early. He should be back soon. Hmm. My friends will be back real soon. Why is he doing that? Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Okay, well, I'm going to go back up to bed. <laughs> Just kidding. Come back over. What do you mean? I live in Burlington. Oh, shit. Everything okay, miss? <laughs> uh, it's my friends. They're almost here. So that's right. Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. Sure about that? Yeah, I'm just overreacted. You need to leave. What did you just say? This is my fucking house. I'll leave when I want to. What do you want? I want what's mine. This house and you. You're trespassing. You need to leave right now. What is he doing? Oh, okay. Ow. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, Rick's the bad guy. Got it. Hey. Oh, God. Okay, I have to close the door behind me or he knows I'm in there. Delightful. Okay, well, that's not good. Let's just go hang out over here and hopefully I don't die this time. What to do now? Is he still down there? No, oh, he is still down there. Okay. There we go. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Hopefully he's not down here. Again.
He's trying to break down the door. Oh, my God. The end. I told them everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick had called the cops. Storm had quieted down by the time they arrived, and of course, the man was nowhere to be seen. On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used, and planned on robbing us during our stay. But cops seemed to think there was more intent behind this man's actions, aside from just robbing us. Rick asked me what the man looked like, and after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on. But in the end, he gave us a full refund. And that's why you pay more than $100 for your Airbnb, everybody. Great. Excellent, as always. Fierce to fathom. I love this series. They're always so good. I hope you enjoyed. News report. Oh, Casey and I'm Dante. Okay, Berlazy, Lily Pichu. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very nice. Um, again, I just, I love this series. It's so much fun. So, I hope you enjoyed. Again, occasional Let's Play when I have a game that I truly want to play. And this was one of them. So, I hope you enjoyed. And we're going to see. I'm going to keep talking in case something else pops up here. Look at all these top supporters. Look at these people. Very cool. Is it just going to go? It's probably just going to go back to the beginning. But you never know what might be happening next. And who that guy was that was knocking at the door the first time. We may never know. You're welcome, by the way. Hooray! That was it. Thank you for watching. Thanks to all the members uh, that are uh, members of the channel. I love you. Thanks to all the subscribers. Uh, I'll see you in the next video. Uh, who knows what it'll be, because I don't know yet as of the time of recording this. Anyways, thanks for watching. I love you. See you next video. Subscribe. Bye-bye.